More than 26,000 students consider UNC Charlotte's 1,000-acre campus their home away from home. At the corner of Cameron Boulevard and Mary Alexander Road, you'll find the UNC Charlotte Student Health Center, whose mission is to promote health and wellness by providing health care, education, and outreach services to all UNC Charlotte students. Our building opened in 2007. It tripled the size of our previous building, and we are already renovating it because we have, uh, we're making room for an additional provider. We have five full-time physicians, all board certified. We have four uh, nurse practitioners and uh, physician assistants. We have a full-time psychiatrist, one of the few in North Carolina that has that. I've been a doctor for 23 years. I'm a family physician by training. And, and I think that family medicine really fits student health very well because as a family physician, you're trained to take care of all variety of things. I think in certain ways we're unique as a student health center. We have a good number of, of providers that all come from various walks of life. They come from different backgrounds. Some have worked in emergency rooms, some have worked in urgent cares, others have worked in family uh, medicine practices uh, or internal medicine practices um, and so come with a, a, a good variety of uh, experience. What I'd like for folks to know about the health centers are all the things that we that we do here. I, I, it is very different than, I, than the usual um, experience of a primary care office out in the rest of the world. So, so in this building we have a full service lab, x-ray capability or radiology department, immunizations, a travel clinic, physical therapy, a full service pharmacy. Um, and so in a very real way, this, is a, this can be a one-stop shop for most students. And it is not at all uncommon for me to see a patient, send them to the lab, they come back, I write them a prescription, um, they get the prescription filled, they make an appointment for physical therapy all before they check out. Um, and they've gotten all that done all in this one place and that really doesn't happen anywhere else. We have a, a full service pharmacy, accepts all insurance cards and, and files all insurance. And it has all pharmaceuticals that any, uh, any student will require plus a wider range of over-the-counter medications. There is a requirement that all students uh, meet certain immunization requirements and our immunization department handles that for all incoming students. We also will do the, the travel immunizations that is required for anyone who has to go abroad. It is a requirement that all students, this is uh, undergraduate six hours who are taking six hours and above and graduate students taking three hours and above have health insurance and our insurance office manages that requirement. The Student Health Center is accredited by the Accreditation Association of Ambulatory Healthcare. This assures that we maintain the highest level of healthcare standards. The Center for Wellness Promotion offers a variety of free services for students on campus, sexual health education and outreach, interpersonal violence and healthy relationships education and outreach, alcohol education, and one-on-one -on -one tobacco counseling, uh, tobacco cessation counseling. The Center for Wellness Promotion offers many signature events throughout the year. Uh, one of the first ones when school starts in the fall is Oktoberfest. Um, it's Oktober, obviously a play on Oktoberfest, but this is an alcohol-free spin on that event. Another event that we do in the fall is World AIDS Day to provide free testing, HIV, AIDS, and syphilis testing to students on campus. And again, it's an event where we have many student organizations come and take part and, and really join in in celebrating and bringing awareness to different events. The Collegiate Recovery Community is one of our newer services here for the university. Um, the community provides academic um, enrichment for students. Um, we provide scholarships for students who are at least six months in sobriety. 
We also offer peer education as far as peer-to-peer -peer mentoring, and then we also offer 12-step programs through our AA, NA, and now this coming fall, our al meeting. meetings. UNC Charlotte is the first in the North Carolina system of universities and colleges to offer a collegiate recovery community. And because of that, we've been contacted by other universities to get a idea of how we set our program up here, some of the services that we offer, and how we were able to furnish a great room down here for students. Um, and that's all because of IKEA Charlotte. The space is fairly small, and so IKEA specializes in furnishing small spaces. And so they believed in our vision and our mission for our students, providing them a safe environment that they can come and feel that they were surrounded in a place that was safe, um, sober, and free for them here on campus. So any student can become involved in the collegiate recovery community. They can just come and volunteer, come and attend some of the 12-step meetings, or come into some of the outreach events. So I think that the health center here does a very good job of seeing all patients from sort of all walks of life. So anybody who's a student on this campus is welcome here and is, is I think, well taken care of here. UNC Charlotte is a very exciting place to be and we're very proud to be part of uh, the university. So we want you all to be excited about wellness and all the opportunities that the Collegiate Recovery Community, the Center for Wellness Promotion, and the Student Health Center offer you here at UNC Charlotte. <music>